Hello and welcome to CCTV42. In this video we're going to look at remote access over the internet to your local network with our System 2 DVR recorders. You enjoy incredibly high levels of functionality on our remote access to these System 2 DVR recorders. Not only does that help you, the user, it also allows us to give you excellent support. If you do have any problems we can remote access your DVR and solve any problems. Here you see the various camera displays being shown. Just as with your normal display, you have a range of options available to you in terms of which cameras are displayed and where. And that includes some large camera displays surrounded by small cameras. And again, just with the normal display, to change which camera is displayed where, simply drag and drop with the mouse. This video isn't intended to show every single function, but just an overview as to the main levels of functionality which are available to you. When remote accessing your DVR system, you have two options in terms of quality available to you. A mainstream and a substream, and you can select either dependent on the speed of your internet access. The control panel allows you to change both local settings on your computer and also remote settings on your DVR recorder. It's very intuitive to use because it's based on exactly the same menu that you have when using your DVR recorder locally at source. Once again, the DVR recorders are supplied with a mouse, so remote access control is second nature. Here, for instance, you can see the recording resolutions for each individual camera, both in terms of resolution, frames per second, maximum bitrate, and so on you have the option to change your recording schedule remotely. Remember this dictates what type of recording happens, what time of day and what day of the week. You can also turn motion detected recording on and off remotely and even change the recording trigger patches as well. You can add them or remove them as easy as that. Once again, it's a simple drag of the mouse. Being able to review network settings remotely can be particularly handy for us when trying to provide remote assistance. The PTZ information is also useful in this instance as well, making sure correct board rates and protocol languages are selected and also that the PTZ camera is assigned to the correct channel. You can assign who gets access to your CCTV system remotely as well and you can also assign each individual user different levels of access to the CCTV system. Not only can you monitor and change the settings on the DVR system remotely, you can also review footage previously recorded on the DV system remotely and even make backups onto your computer system. Here we can see a search for a motion detected recording patch which has taken place earlier on in the day. You can remotely access all the footage stored on your DVR recorder. You can review it, and if need be, you can make backups to your local computer. Here we can see a backup being made. You search the DVR for the correct footage, select which footage you want to backup, and tell the local computer where you want to store that backup, and then download onto the local computer. Once downloaded, you can make disks, you can email the footage, and so on. Once again, in an emergency, this allows us to provide extremely good support to our DVR users. Here you can see remote control of a PTZ camera over the internet. You have a high level of functionality. You can move the camera, you can adjust the speed of the movement, you can adjust zoom, and you can also use the preset points and also instigate a tour between those preset points. As well as PTZ control, our System 2 DVR recorders support two-way audio. That means you can monitor audio on your CCTV system and you can also talk to your CCTV system or rather the people who are being viewed on it. This makes our System 2 DVR recorders particularly useful for remote monitoring of sites. Well that's given you a very brief overview as to the functionality you'll enjoy when remote accessing your System 2 DVR recorder. As I say, it's not intended to be a user guide or cover every single function, 
but it gives you an idea of what's available. For more information, simply go on the website or call us directly and we're always happy to have a chat. I hope you found that useful. My name's Henry, we're CCTV42. Many thanks for watching.